Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Friday. It's Friday, so it is hashtag Friday Hauls. And Friday Hauls is hosted by Lois over at Life with Lois, and I'll put her channel down below so you can go over and check her out. Today for Friday Hauls, I have a Walmart haul. I think I went in there for about 10 things, but came out with a couple extra. Not a lot, but a little. Y'all know how that is when you go to Walmart. You always end up picking up a little bit more than you bargained for. So I got um, these frozen whole strawberries because I have a, a de dessert recipe that I want to do, which you'll probably see that dessert on um, uh, Mix It Up in the Kitchen on this is probably the Saturday before this one even comes out because I've already got one pre-recorded for Friday for Friday haul. So this will go on the following week. <laughs> so yeah. Anyways, um, I also got some of uh, Sargento Colby Jack teas. Um, and then if we do like burgers on the grill or something over the weekend, we'll have that, but also for grilled cheese and sandwiches. And then I got some um, of the mozzarella cheese and the pepper jack cheese. Since I got that shredder that I really like from Amazon, I would much rather um, buy the block cheese than the shredded cheese. I'd rather shred it myself and know there's not like a lot of grossness. <laughs> Let's just say that in the packaging. Um, and then I also got some of the Oscar Mayer uh, smoked turkey breast for my husband. He wanted some lunch meat. And then we got a pack of the uh, large white eggs. Um, he also asked to pick up some horseradish sauce. It's kind of becoming like a staple in our house um, with other condiments. And then we picked up, my daughter got some of the Taco Bell mild taco, taco seasoning, because we tend to have Taco Tuesday or enchiladas or some kind of Mexican dish at least once a week. We love Mexican food, but we love our Italian food too, but we're trying to be good and stay away from the pasta so much. Um, and then we got some of the extra virgin olive oil. We were out of that, so we got that. And then uh, I got a bag of potatoes because we plan to do um, baked potatoes one night for dinner. We have on the menu, we're gonna do um, ribs on the grill and steaks, and we figured we'd do some baked potatoes with it. So we got that. And then um, I picked this up because with summer coming, I wanna go back to a little bit lighter. I know it probably doesn't look too dark right now, um, but it's super dark. It's darker than I normally wear. Um, and I, t I typically get, oh, what is the name? I cannot think. Belle, do you remember the name of that brand that I typically get for for um, hair coloring? L'Oreal. Was it the L'Oreal? No, that I normally, huh? Revlon. Revlon, yes. That's the one that I typically get. But this time, I paid a little bit more and got the L'Oreal. Um, and the color is called Extra Light Natural Blonde. When I get it, I usually like to get the natural blonde. And then my daughter got some of the Dove Refreshing Cucumber and Green Tea Body Wash. I've been wanting to try some of their Dove um, body washes. So I do want to try those, one of those soon. And then, um, hold on one second. Okay, and just a few more things. So I picked up some of the Chicken Bites Baked Snacked crackers. There was complaints in the house that there was no crackers, so I got some crackers. And then I got, I, we love these, the Santitas yellow corn. I've been craving like um, uh, loaded nachos, so I think we'll do that one night. Maybe we'll do that for Taco Tuesday next week. I got two of the lemon lime soda, the twist up. That's what Walmart has changed their brand look to. And then I got some of the um, Blueberry Muffin McCafes for my husband for work. And there's 24 in there. Or maybe that's for the house, I don't know. He just told me he needed some, so. <laughs> um, and then I got the Tricolor Tortilla Strips. Yeah. Yeah, because I haven't been drinking as much coffee lately. Um, 
I have been drinking my Tezo chai tea latte, and I've been seeing a lot of y'all do your Dollar Tree walkthroughs, and they have it at the Dollar Tree. I can't tell by y'all's video if it's in the dollar aisle, the dollar twenty-five aisle, or if it's in the three and five dollar aisle. But even if it's in the five dollar aisle, I'd like to find it because it's still more than that at the grocery stores. It's still more than five dollars. Um, but it's so, so good. And I'd like to think it's healthier for me than coffee, but I could be wrong. <laughs> and then I got two of the strawberry gelatin as <laughs> a talk about healthier. This is for a dessert. <laughs> I got two of the, um, strawberry gelatin. Um, and then I, my daughter got two of the, um, smoked Gouda. These are her favorite two boxes of those smoked gouda macaroni and cheese. I got a thing of the creamy peanut butter because we are finally running out of peanut butter in our house. We had a bunch stocked up for a while. And then I also got the crunchy peanut butter for those of us who like, I like both, but then there's some that likes just one and some that likes the other. And then I also got a thing of two of the Rotel that is for dinner tonight. And then we got four of the um, cans of green bean because I went to make some green beans or I, I plan to make it this week. It's on the menu um, with one of our meals. And there was one can of green beans. I said, are you kidding me? <laughs> one can. So yeah, we definitely needed to get that. And then also something that I was about out of, if I could get over here. I'm trying not, not to get out of the camera view. Um, is some flour. We were very, very low, and that's taken us a long time to get out of that as well. But, and then my daughter picked up a thing of the pate turkey and giblets special kitty. She just likes to give her kitties a little bit of this once in a while in with their dry food. And then, um, we also got the Chick fil A sauce. We were gonna go to Food Lion, and we were gonna get the Chick fil A and the Bojangles. Um, but we just, we just went to Walmart. Um, anyways, just got a message, so I need to go pick something up. Oh, let me show you. These are the non-food items that I got, that we got. Uh, we picked up the Sweet Sugar Lemon. Highly recommend. This stuff smells amazing for your, um, candle, uh, your wax candle melts. It smells so good. And then I picked up for the house, it's called Fall Farmhouse. But it actually smells like, to me, it smells like a man's cologne. That's what it looks like on the front. It smells so good, so, so good. And then um, I got the e.l.f. Uh, lip balm and peach. And my daughter got it in the vanilla. And then we both got um, the, no, the e.l.f. No Budge Retractable Eyeliner. Um, these are really reasonable too, and they work really well. We both got it in the brown. She, no, she, yeah, she got it in the brown too. And then she also got a eyeliner brush from e.l.f. And then I saw these on the clearance aisle. They did not have a lot down our clearance aisle, um, but they had these Patchology Mood Patch um, for your under your eyes, and they were on clearance for a dollar. I got two of those. I should have, honestly, I should have just grabbed up what they had. That was a really good price. But anyways, that is my Walmart haul. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Please go check out Lois and everyone else in this open collab. And I know Lois would love for you to join us. And I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And until next time, bye y'all.